Among Ghostbusters Frozen Empire's various intermingling narratives is that of an endearing connection between McKenna Grace's character, Phoebe Spangler, and Melody, a spectral presence portrayed by Emily Ellen Lind. While very much a ghost, rather than echoing the antics of franchise mainstays such as Slimer, Melody in the form of a 16-year-old girl is treated similarly in the vein of Ghostbusters Afterlife's Ghost Egon, and in Frozen Empire captures the attention and affection of the young Spangler following a park-based chess match. In a new interview with The Hollywood Reporter, Lind discusses her role as Melody, including why she feels the character was likely left off nearly all marketing materials surrounding the film. I asked the same question. I was a little confused as well, but I think it's because this is a very different kind of ghost for the Ghostbusters franchise. She's a ghost with a heart, she's a ghost that has a full human relationship, so I think there was a part of them that really wanted to catch people off guard in that sense. And this secret nature of Frozen Empire, it wasn't just isolated to the film's marketing, as even in pre-production, at first, Lynn was unaware that Melody was even a ghost, with the character being written to be relatable in very much a human-like way. I met with director Gil Kinnan a few times to delve into the character, and he never mentioned that I was playing a ghost, but he was like, I think you'll like it, there's a few surprises there. And when I finally read that she's a ghost, I said, what? Since the release of Frozen Empire, Phoebe and Melody's friendship has been a talking point among some fans, with many picking up on a potential romance between the two. While there's clearly an emotional attachment, especially given the lengths that Grace's character goes to in an attempt to seek a further connection with Melody, the relationship is left up to interpretation, with Lynn saying, Phoebe and Melody are cut from the same cloth in a lot of ways. They're both outsiders in their own ways. They're both old souls, figuratively and literally. And since physical touch was off the table, that can get pretty irritating in the beginning of any relationship. So Phoebe just wanted to be able to be close to this person. Your question is basically, is this a romantic relationship or a friendship? And a lot of people are asking that. But the beauty of this movie is that it's just two souls connecting. The fact that they literally can't touch is a metaphor for their deeper soul connection that defies labels. I like that we didn't define it as one thing or another. Sometimes when people do that, it ruins it. It's too concrete and absolute, and they're so not absolute as characters. Now last month, as part of Ghostbusters Frozen Empire's world premiere in New York City, Ghostbusters News had the chance to catch a word with Emily Allen Lind. To watch that interview, as well as similar features with both Celeste O'Connor and Logan Kim, check out the link down below in this video's description. With that said, that's all I've got for you for this one. As always, subscribe. If you'd like to join up with Ghostbusters News, check out our Patreon page. A link to that is down below, and we'll see you right back here next time. <laughs>